All right, so there you have it, the world premiere of the MX versus ATV All Out gameplay trailer. We've been waiting for this, and it was awesome. If that doesn't get you pumped up, I don't know what's going to. Now, this was all unfiltered in-game gameplay footage. Nothing's been touched, nothing, just in-game footage. The band playing was Asking Alexandria. They've been brought on to be a part of the soundtrack. So I think the soundtrack's going to be really, really cool. I'm excited for that. I know some people... Don't care about that as much as others, but I actually like listening to it. Maybe not for YouTube videos, but I think this is going to be a really good one. Two strokes are confirmed. If you see that first shot of the bike whipping, you can tell that is a two stroke. Also confirmed is Fox Gear 60 helmets, Ride 365, Alias 7, and Fast House Gear. Some companies being a part of the game for a while, some companies being brand new and getting brought in. So I think that's really cool. Indoor UTV racing, which could be really interesting. The Rainbow and Nordic bikes have been totally redone from the ground up. Now, I know a lot of people, myself included, like the actual manufacturer bikes, but I would assume maybe eventually they'll get brought into the game like they usually do. But the Nordic and Rainbow bikes have been in the game forever, so it's not anything new to have them in the game, and I think it's nice that they didn't reuse anything. They're totally new. As well as you can use single or dual exhaust. Now, with the CRF, obviously, and Encore, you could use the single or dual exhaust but not on the THQ Rainbow Bike. So that's a new feature. 5150 Energy Drink has been brought on in the game. Dunlop and Gibson Tires, which is totally sick because in real life I run Dunlop. I don't really run anything else. So it's cool to use Dunlop in the game. That's never been done before in MX versus ATV, I believe. So that's nice to see. And new stadiums. So the game's going to be totally sick. I am so pumped. Short trailer, but there's actually a lot you can see if you... Uh, dissect it and kind of analyze it a little bit. Now, release date is set for March 27th, which I believe is a Tuesday. So keep that day open because that's when the game's coming out. It is set to release for $49.99. Now, pre-orders, I know a lot of people don't pre-order. I don't usually pre-order games either. I've only pre-ordered a couple games, I think. And a lot of times you don't really get an incentive or a bonus. Now, they're going to give you some pretty good deals here. If you pre-order from Amazon Prime, or Amazon and you have Amazon Prime, you get 20% off. Not too bad. If you pre-order digitally, you get early access by four days, which is insane. That's like the best deal. And then if you pre-order through like GameStop, you get 100,000 Moto Coins, which is insane. Now, Moto Coins are the in-game currency. I repeat, not DLC. I repeat, not DLC. It's in the game. You earn Moto Coins by racing in races, winning races, stuff like that. You use the Moto Coins to unlock the bikes, parts, gear, stuff like that. So getting 100,000 Moto Coins right away will unlock a lot of stuff. So if you're going to buy the game anyways, these are some pretty decent bonuses and incentives to, to pre-order. So if you want to pre-order, I will have links to MX versus ATV their website, and you just scroll down and choose what platform you want it for. I'll have that link in the description, as well as GameStops and their Facebook page. So if you want to go check out their Facebook page, I usually link that as well. So check the description. That's how you get the game. And I think a lot of that stuff is worth it, especially the digital download and the GameStop. I think those are really, really good deals. So make sure to check that out. I think this is going to be great. I'm excited. The whips look totally different, totally pumped. So Leave a like if you guys are pumped for this game. Let me know in the comments what you think. I'm curious. I like reading your thoughts and opinions on it and stuff like that. But you guys and girls are absolutely amazing. Thank you so much for the support on the channel lately. And I'm going to leave you guys with the gameplay trailer one more time with the music and sound. So you guys and girls are absolutely amazing. And until the next video, take it easy.